Hi guys and welcome to another Nexus 7 video looking at the Jelly Bean 4.2 update and what new features we have. This is the second video in the small series that I'm doing and in this video I'm going to look at how notifications have changed. So if we just go to the top of the screen and if I swipe down you will see that uh, notifications look fairly similar to what they were previously but look what's disappeared here. Previously we had a lock screen button and also a button to get into your settings but they've now disappeared and that seems rather odd to take away some functionality from a device well it's not quite that simple because if you noticed I swiped down from this part of the screen the left hand side even if I do it from the middle it's going to bring down my regular notifications however in this right third of the screen if I scroll down we get settings so it's a new type of option from the top of the screen and it gives you quite a few nice default options so for example I can quickly go to brightness and change that swipe down again and I can quickly set it back up uh, I can look at my battery very quickly from the screen swipe down again so I can do it from any screen as well it's not just a home screen I can turn on Bluetooth I can put it into airplane mode quickly check my uh, network settings or I can go into the general settings as well now the final option is my uh, lovely face there. If I press on that, that's going to send me back to the home screen and then I have the option to actually change profiles. Now we're going to profiles a little bit later, but that's just a quick demonstration of how I can sw quickly switch from one profile to the other. So I've now actually switched to a brand new profile. If I scroll down again, press on my name, well I'm actually on that screen, but it would take me again back to this home screen and I could switch back to uh, the other one. You can also bring down the uh, notification um, from the lock screen, uh, but you can't bring down both notifications at the same time. So if you scroll down with two fingers, uh, you're just going to sort of switch between the two if I quickly do that. So some nice added functionality there, um, but just be aware of it because uh, when my friends and I first downloaded the update, we were thinking, where the hell have, has my um, little settings gone there? but it's actually been added with, it's probably about up to, I'd say about there, that's as far as you can go, about a third of the right hand side of the screen. If you do it in the middle, it's going to bring down your normal notifications. So thanks for watching guys, I hope you found that useful. And we'll be looking at another aspect of the Jelly Bean 4.2 update very soon in another video. Take care and I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please click that thumbs up button. I really appreciate it. And if you're hungry for more videos, subscribe. It's free after all.